Well, the annual Sanka Lucia Fest marks the start of the Christmas celebrations in Swedish culture. The Bemidji affiliate of the American Swedish Institute hosts the traditional event with a full feast and ceremony each year. Mel Meyer has more on the festivities for this week's In Focus. People from all over traveled in darkness to the Festival of Lights, which pays tribute to St. Lucia. She brought the light back to the, uh, to the people. She was a, a saint. According to legend, she devoted her life to her faith and the poor. She was killed but later appeared during a famine as a woman in white with a glow around her head. Before the festival, the Swedish are expected to have their homes cleaned and trees up so they can relax. Today, then they could start to really celebrate by visiting each other in their homes, serving lavish cookies and coffees, probably drinking glug sometimes. The celebration brings people together, which is what the Bemidji chapter of the American Swedish Institute wants to do with their events. It encourages us to be involved in, in our Swedish ancestry and it also encourages us to, to learn more about, about ourselves and our her heritage. Sharon Fertel's grandfather immigrated from Sweden. The customs he continued to share during her childhood are very special to her, which is why she enjoys this festival. It's a connection with the past, a connection with my family, and it's just a beautiful tradition, I think. For some families, this is something they are very involved with every year. We have three kids and they all sang in the Tumsa Choir and then progressed to Starboys and, and eventually our daughter was Lucia in 1997. This year's Lucia said that she's been a part of the procession since she was four. Super exciting, it's like everything that I've ever wanted. Her favorite part of being Lucia? I think it was wearing the candles really because I just felt so like, I don't know, it's hard to explain. The excitement in the events will help keep their traditions alive. We want to keep our culture going. <laughs> So we remember uh, where we came from. According to tradition, the holiday celebration should continue until mid-January. In Bemidji with this week's In Focus, I'm Mal Meyer, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.